Hi, my name is Rosie Detterlein, and I'm a clinical aromatherapist who has founded Oils of Chacon in partnership with Jesus. I have here Michelle Gaber, and we are going to share some testimonies today about how um, the biblical oil and prayer has worked together in healing different people. Michelle? Okay. Yeah, I just want to share a testimony that's kind of been over a period of time for me. Um, in particular, I want to talk about the last year. The last year, I have incorporated this biblical oil blend into my daily lifestyle, and I've been battling anxiety for a while now. And over the last years, I've been incorporating this, along with other things, into my daily life. Um, it's really, I've really seen an improvement. What I like about this is I love the, the, the smell of it, the different oils that are in it. And one I want to highlight in particular is hyssop and um, a Bible verse that was made known to me by actually Rosie um, incorporated with this biblical oil blend here um, is Psalms 51 7 and in that it talks about hyssop again and it says cleanse me with hyssop that I may be clean wash me and I will be whiter than snow and I've just felt that I've felt that over the last year I've just felt just this cleansing process happening in my life and um, I use this um, primarily during massages. I'll ask my husband to use this, this oil. So I'm just so thankful for this oil in my life and I'm so thankful for just the connection between the spiritual in the Bible and um, the physical connection with it. So praise God. Thank you, Michelle. And I had, in your case, you, it took you some time to, to come about anxiety and to receive some healing from that. Mm -hmm. I'd like to share a testimony of healing that happened on the spot. I was at a music festival, a Christian music festival last summer, and there was a gentleman who came up to me and he said, I had a pain in my foot, you know, do you have anything for that? And um, I normally would use uh, a particular blend that I use for like arthritis and, and, and pain, but um, but as I prayed, I, I, I felt led to use the, this biblical oil, which contains different oils of the Bible, including frankincense, myrrh, hyssop, spikenard, and cassia. And so we sat down and we prayed and I asked him, I said, do you believe in, in faith that Jesus can heal you? And he said, yes, I do. So we prayed and um, in Jesus' name for healing. And afterwards, I asked him, you know, um, how do you feel? So he stood up and he said, there's some improvement. I don't have the intense pain that I had before. So I said, all right, sit down and we'll pray some more. We prayed some more and uh, asked him to stand up and uh, he stood up again and he said, I have no pain. I have, wow, I have no pain. He was jumping on it and he couldn't even, like he could hardly walk on it um, prior to the prayer time. So, you know, I, I just wanted to share that, that when we pray in faith in combination with oils, um, because both are, are instructed in the Bible, you know, to, um, to it's, by, it's by your faith that you're healed and also to anoint and to pray with oil. So in my observation in the last couple of years, I've noticed an exponential effect of the combination of praying um, in faith in combination with um, biblical oils and also contemporary oils that Jesus designed with healing properties. Um, because he designed our bodies and he designed what we need. So just share that with you. And um, if you are interested in getting the biblical oil, either the 10 milliliter or the 30 milliliter, you can go to the website. And I wish fragrant blessings to you.